Ever wonder what it takes to open a high-end restaurant or club? From choosing the perfect location, building the perfect menu, Home and Lifestyle TV takes you behind the scenes to see how the up-and-coming Tuscany Art and Dining is doing it all. Darby from Home and Lifestyle TV and today I've caught up with Clayton Phillips. Hey Tara. <laughs> How are you? Fantastic. Now this is the guy behind the vision for Tuscany Art and Dining and with today's segment we'll be taking you to the birth of a restaurant and with this series spanning over the next five episodes we'll show you exactly what it takes to build a DFW hotspot. Now follow us. Okay, so explain to me exactly everything we're going to see once it's complete. On our ground floor we have a great banquet room. We have a bar downstairs with private dining booths, uh, an expansive dining room here, our garden patio. We even have some small private dining areas wow. for those intimate nights. Uh, so where these you can, can have be reserved for parties, I guess. Absolutely. Just as small yeah. or if you have a big to-do. Right. Uh, Tell me about the rooftop dining. That yeah, this like is fun. really this is really <laughs> interesting. Uh, we you know we have our own in-house elevator, our stairwell that comes up. Mm -hmm. uh, we have there. our founders room upstairs, which is going to be a nice intimate dining for up to 14. Our wine vaults upstairs. Okay, now this part looks interesting. What is all that open space up there? Yeah, this is really interesting. We what we wanted to do is we created this interior stairwell, beautiful mm -hmm. iron case stairwell, mm -hmm. and this will go all the way upstairs to the sky bar. And what we had to specifically engineer this into the plans so that we could get the look we're after. We want to bring in the, the whole uh, feel. Of, you know, when you go to Tuscany, it's so beautiful. You don't want to box it in. No. You know, you want light, you want plants, you want beauty. Okay. And out here, our patio, our garden patio, will this will this will all kind of blend into our garden patio. With travertine flooring, beautiful plants, chandeliers. So the garden experience is going to be just like you're in Italy. So explain to me what you mean by art and dining. Yeah, I'll tell you, art and dining to me is cuisine mm -hmm. and the ambiance and the people. Yeah. I think we've reached the Sky Bar, which is probably going to be my personal favorite part of this restaurant. <laughs> tell me what's going to be going on out here. What we've created here is a, a Sky Bar, a terrace, rooftop dining, if you will, where you can actually come out and enjoy the ambiance of the uh, resorts, the, the lake you can see right over here yeah. a little bit, uh, and have, um, you know, we're going to put travertine flooring in here with beautiful plants, a high ceiling, string lights, real festive. And right here, uh, what we're going to do is create a retractable roof. Oh, wow. So that you, these will be 20 foot by 10 foot retractable panels, that is so and cool. you can actually sit under the stars. Oh, well, Clayton, thank you so much for that amazing tour, but where are we heading now? Oh, this is the best part of the whole tour. We're going to the test kitchen, Ooh. and we've got something really special to show you all. Let's, Let's go. go. So this is where it all begins. This is the war room. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> well, you know, you know, generals get ready for war. Well, mm -hmm. restaurant managers and owners get ready for war every day. For grand openings. For, grand openings, <laughs> for great banquets, you know. Uh -huh. and, and this is our uh, test kitchen, our R&D kitchen. We have great uh, products we're fixing for tonight's gala. Uh, even down to the herb selections. Uh -huh. uh, we have to test different flavor profiles to make sure they work. And then you have to figure out how to make it for 500 people. So Clayton suited me up with an official chef's apron and gloves. Well, here we are, Tara. It's your big <laughs> opportunity to do the chef thing. Our executive chef, Danny, is going to take you right through the process. <laughs> okay. Well, we have our mushrooms here that we've sauteed in the with a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of uh, Mediterranean salt. We added some chopped spinach with herbs, garlic, and olive oil. Next, we added a bit of jumbo lumped crab seasoned with fresh herbs. Then we topped it with an au gratin herb butter. Then into the oven for just a few minutes. All those flavors will just mingle down through the whole mushroom. And the whole, every, every bite will just be loaded with flavor and richness. It's fantastic. Mm -hmm. Everyone's talking about high def, but what about your eyes? With four locations and over 40,000 contacts in stock, you can have your prescription the same day. See life in high def with contacts from contact lens centers. Hi, and welcome back to Home and Lifestyle TV. I'm your 
host, Tara Darby, and as you can see, it is party time. I finally made it over to the Founders Party, and now I want to introduce you to some of the key players behind the creation of Tuscany Art and Dining. Now I'm here with Bob Mason, and Bob, I want you to tell me about what your involvement is with Tuscany Art and Dining. Well, we are going to um, represent and help thousands of children all over the world. We'll help some here in the United States, but primarily in Central and South America, South Europe, Africa, Southeast Asia, India. There's tremendous need with children everywhere. So you can eat at Tuscany right. and know that not only are you filling your own belly, but you're also filling bellies of children all over the world. To have the ability to take that very premise of feeding and the wonderful food yeah. and take that to the world where they need it so desperately. It just fills mine and Clayton's heart to realize we can really make a difference and really have an impact in many of these countries for the children. That is just so inspiring and I just want to thank you for your compassion and, and for that vision. That's just so important. Thank you so much. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> well, of course tonight I bumped into Clayton Phillips. Now you remember oh, this, no. right? Oh, yes. It wasn't long ago. I think you made it these. Wasn't. And this is your own creation, so you got to try this now. Now, this one's kind of messy and yeah, big. I think that's the yours. one that I made. Yeah. <laughs> Here goes so. nothing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> mm, that is delicious. What? Okay. And here's to you in Tuscany Art Night.